Ah, ah, I'm gonna run over the shoot, over shoot the platform. Ah. Hi everyone, this is Reese's Trains again, and we are at Leeds Station in Railworks Train Simulator. And today I thought I'll take a Class One Five A from Leeds to Selby on a Halifax to Hull route via Bradford Interchange. But we're starting at Leeds and we'll end at Selby because this is still part of the Harrogate loop line. So um, we obviously can't go that far uh, between, you know, from Halifax all the way to Hull because that route hasn't been made in train sim, I don't think. But we can go as far as Selby. Load the passengers. Let the train doors close. Right. Let's get the train going. Only if the seats are actually like, you know, the northern seats. What they have in the free carriage variant of the 158s. There's the quarry house over there. There you go, off the bridge. I don't know why it does that. Right, let's continue straight on. We should be good to travel now to 55, so let's even... He's inside the... one of the carriages. There's Neville Hill there.
And once we're past Neville Hill, there's no electric wires. Although, in real life, they are planning to, as part of the Trans Pennine Express route upgrade, to install electric wires along between Leeds and York to make it more greener. So that'll be interesting once it's up, because I know currently the Class 195s and um, the 185s from Trans Pennine Express, of course, as I mentioned, the 195s from Northern. And a variety of other diesel trains, including the cross countries, come through here. Cross country voyages. Which I did showcase on Tuesday's video when I was at Micklefield Station, which we will be passing on the way to Selby. Slow down for cross gates then. So we'll be stopping at Crossgates, Garforth, East Garforth, Micklefield, South Milford and Selby for this particular run. Just slows down gradually here. Sixteen miles away from Selby. Our next stop today will be Garforth. Approaching Garforth. So this is pointless because we're stopping at Garforth and then about 0.6 miles later we have to stop at East Garforth as well. I mean, those stations, in my opinion, are just too near to each other. Garforth. Sorry mate, you've missed the train. You're second too late. another station. This is East Garforth.
Ah, ah, I'm gonna run over the shoot over shoot the platform. Ah, I think I did. Crap. Right, let's go. Let's go for Micklefield next. Here's Micklefield Station. There we go. We're not going to York, this one's going to Hull. And this is the station I was at in real life on this Tuesday's video. Right, let's continue for South Milford and then Selby. Normally I go up that way when I head towards York. And you go down this way to head towards Hull, which you probably saw in um, Tuesday's video. Next station will be South Milford. A downward um, descent for a while, so it allows me to put my foot down and Hopefully get to this train's top speed of 90 miles an hour, although probably not going to have much luck because South Milford's literally in a um, couple miles, so I'm probably not going to have much luck getting to 90 anyway, because by the time I get to 80, 85, I'll have to slow down again. Yeah, as I rightly predicted, I'm going to have to slow down now, as I risk over overshooting the platform. I'm a bit worried. It's a smaller platform here, so I have to need to be careful how I slow this train down. We've made it to South Milford. We've only got one more station to go before the end of the video. So, right, let's head for Selby in seven miles from now. Probably just gonna let the train cruise along now. What's this here? Aren't these some form of sidings around here? My guess is they are to some degree. Get a couple screenshots of this train while we're going. Eighty five. Ah, this is going to be close. And we made it to 90!
bring this train to a stop. And here we are at Selby. Right, so that's going to conclude this gameplay of taking a 158 from Leeds to Selby down the whole line. So I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.